Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Kayla, Crafty Pen Pal Mama. So, this video is a product share, um, a design team share for a adorable little shop on AliExpress called Selena Studio. So, I did get these guys a little while back and I'm a little late posting them because life happened. <laughs> you all know what I mean, I'm sure. So, um... I say better late than never <laughs> and um, I'm gonna get started and show you guys what Selena sent me so first I'm gonna start with the dies um, and first I want to show you this so her dies come like this um, in a little plastic uh, sleeve um, but just for just a few cents more you can also choose to get the envelope for it um, for storage you can see it's got the line there it's got the tuck spot and for just a few cents more you have your little um, storage pocket you don't have to label it her little logo is already on there you know where it came from so yeah um, I didn't realize that I had only done it to one so I did only get one because that's what I chose. Um, so, all right, let's get started. So this one obviously came in this envelope. Um, so this is a little dress and it's got your little score marks for your pleats, belt, the top, a hanger, you know, your layering bow pieces. And I was gonna give a measurement, but this one's a little hard for a measurement without um, it being put together. I can tell you the length of the skirt is two inches. And then your top piece here for like your top is one and a quarter. So there's that one. And I really love that her dies are teal. I love, love, love colored dies. Um, there are some companies, lots of us know, who are known for certain colored dies. So I really like these, that they're colored. Okay, next is this cute little koala bear set. They're like hugging each other. Once you put the arms and the, all the layering pieces on there, they're sitting and hugging each other. Super cute. And the body part here is mm, almost two and a half inches tall. So that can give you a, a rough estimate of the size. And um, I also will have these dies linked in the description as well as Selena's shop on Alley, so you guys can go check her out. Next is this, oh it is adorable. I think I did already cut this one to kind of see what it was going to look like. So this is like a little bouquet um, wrap. Um, like when you get flowers from someone, it'll have the flowers are in this wrap. So it's got all the score marks so you know where to fold it and then you get your little bow piece and a little heart for your center so I didn't put it completely together but I did cut out um, the biggest part here the wrap and um, I made a mistake on one of my folds so it's not perfect but this is what it looks like and I thought this would be super cute to put together some flowers that have stems um, and this be, uh, cut out of vellum, or you could put, you could still put flowers in it and maybe have like a tassel hanging out of this end. I thought that was super adorable. So yeah, I'm definitely going to have fun playing with that one. And the picture shows flowers, um, the example shows flowers in the bouquet, and some are similar to these. They're not the exact ones, um, but I believe these will work for that as well. Um, of course, we probably all have flower dyes in our stash that can work. So this set, you have one, two, three flower, um, actual flower with petals. And then this is like a little uh, thing of berries. And then you have the small and large um, like stem of leaves and then a smaller wide leaf there so cute and then next is this adorable little it's like i'm call it a heart wreath so you have your heart and your flowers are in the shape of the wreath 
and then you have these pieces in the middle the flowers can be layered with the other ones to make it fuller it can be layered on top of the other ones and then you have these butterflies uh, or a butterfly here in the middle with some layering pieces And I have not played with all of these yet, like I said, but I can already see <laughs> what these are going to be. Oh, there's glare. Oh, I'm so sorry. Mm. Nope, that's not fixing it. I do apologize about that. That glare, I have a one of my newer um, large lights on. Okay, so here's the next one. It is this cute little bow die. Um, well, you can't really see it because of that little sticker there on the front so I'm going to take it out and show you so you got this cute little bow with all the little details in it and it, the bottom details swoop down and then you've got that piece here for your uh, center of your bow to layer it I cannot wait to cut this one out it's gonna be so fun oh and this one I don't think I measured all of them but this one let's see I'm about the highest point of the bow to the lowest point is right at two inches and then it is like two and an eighth inch wide all right and then the next one is this cute little bunny set I did think it was bigger but now that I have it and I see the size of it I absolutely love how tiny it is so you have this adorable little bunny here and then you have some layering pieces say for his ears I believe and then you have this little cluster of clovers and flowers. Um, and then you can, you know, obviously do whatever colors you want. And then here's some stems. Super adorable. And this little guy measures one and three-fourths of an inch tall. Just the bunny. He is so cute. And then next is this cute little uh, mailbox so you have your outer piece here you have um, the front piece with a slot you've got some pieces for layering the heart for that um, I can't remember exactly what okay so the square makes your layering piece here under the heart and then if I'm not mistaken this piece here you put on and it looks like the uh, mailbox is open um, so I'm definitely going to have to put that one together and show you guys. And I will put these together um, and do at least an example of each one and come back with a video to show you guys what they look like. Okay, and the next one here is this little embroidery hoop. It's just a hoop and you've got your little pin up there. I thought that would be a great little piece, um, base piece for a shaker or anything really. So from that top post point, it's right at two and a quarter inches, counting that top piece. And next, oh, this was one of my favorite ones as well. So this is a little cassette tape. Is that not adorable? I love it. So you've got the your piece here for writing uh, the label on your tape. You know, it goes here. And then you've got the little round things um, that go here um, that has the tape. And that's also your layering piece for the middle. More layering pieces. Super adorable. I cannot wait to play with this one. Oh, I love it. You can see the embossing details all over. I love, love, love it. In this tape, um, the base, just this top part, see from the widest point is three and one eighth of an inch wide and one and seven eighths of an inch tall so that is going to be super cute when i put it together <coughs> excuse me and then we have just a couple of more so the next one here is um like a wreath piece so these um they're all together but they actually cut individually if you can see they're not attached um this one is one piece so you can use these as leaves for you know a different project as layering pieces to pop out behind things or to um 
fill in your wreath here and make it a big full little wreath. And then next is this flower. I actually saw something similar to this a long time ago and then I never could find a die for it. Um, so it is two pieces. You have your base piece and then your layering piece. And I guess you could probably make a shaker since it does have that uh, frame piece around. Um, but this will be a fun little flower to play with and use on a project. And it is about three and a quarter inches across. And then last but not least of the dies is this cute little envelope die. And it's got this chevron embossing design on the top for your flap. super cute and when this is put together the envelope would be right at see two and three fourths of an inch yeah so this square piece here is going to be the size of your envelope once it's finished um this is, this is your side pieces you would fold those in and it does give you your score marks there and there so you know where to fold it so you would fold those in put glue on them and then put close this piece up over and then you also have your or you can do it the other way so that your embossing is on the outside depends on which way you want it uh or how you want it to show with that embossed design i love 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 that all right and then she also has paper and ephemera and I wanted to show you this one. Um, the one I chose is called Dreamlike World. So here's the paper pad. This is an 8 inch. And I do believe she has 12 inch if I'm not mistaken. So I wanted to flip through right quick and show you guys this. So 36 sheets, 12 designs. And it's not um, that thin paper. It is like designer cardstock has some good weight to it so you have the purple design of flowers and this is like wood grain but it's pink i hope my light is bright enough to show you that it almost looks like it has texture that is so beautiful okay and then we have this cute yellow gingham design polka dots and then like this blue distressing around the sides love 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 that i hope my camera is picking it up and then this one i'm not sure if that's maybe mermaid scales i don't know but i love the color love 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 that teal color for some reason i don't think it's picking up right on the camera as a teal color but it is a light teal color similar to this and then this is a cream color, little diamond designs with dots. Um, a different diamond design with square, like little diamonds in the middle, and it's blue with white. This cute one here with houses all over. Super adorable. And this page here with butterflies and flowers. I love that. Let's see, and this looks like... It almost looks like roses, if you can see that design. Little swirled roses. And it is also the teal color that's similar to the dye. And we have this um, diagonal stripes in rainbow color. This one, oh, so pretty. So it's like a mint green background. And then all these clusters of flowers. That is gorgeous. And then it repeats. Yeah, so you get three of each design. And that one's called Dreamlike World. <coughs> Excuse me. And then she also sent me the ephemera. So it comes in a pack like this. This is the ephemera for this collection. So I did get two packs. Um, I like to have doubles or, you know, or extra pieces to work with. So I have them right here um, on this plate to share with you let me um, take some of these off and show you what we have a little coffee there let's see flowers a brush uh, let's see recorded 
flowers, um, a magical day, another flower, and there's these uh, little like glass slippers, if you can see that, here and here, so you have like earring and necklace sets that match, there's a ring, another flower, another pair of earrings, oh, I can't pick that one up, that's another flower, Let's see, and then we have this little bouquet here of flowers. We have lots of little um, word pieces here. Let's see, a dream come true. Happy, happy, happy. Royal makeover. Princess tea party. Let's see, princess for a day. Some hearts. Let's see, what did I drop? That's another little pair of earrings. Um, some more flowers. Very pretty. We've got this cute little ticket. It says free hugs. Flowers and leaves. More. See, so just add sparkles. Bloom and grow. Discover. My favorite princess. And then here's a little piece. Um, it's like a little ephemera piece. And it says, come fly with me. With a little hot air balloon on there. And then, let's see, another bouquet of flowers. That one is similar to the die cut. Another little floral piece. Flowers. A comb. Hashtag lovable. And then this little uh, princess gown here. Let's see, girl power. The little carriage, and that's actually the carriage here um, under the word Dreamlight World. And then a little tote bag, a bow. And this is, um, yeah, this is a radio. I love, love that. And it says AM and FM there. Love that. Here's a little notebook, an alarm clock, a stack of books. See a little stamp. Here is oh, here's our teapot, and I think I see the yeah teacup. See a little tag, butterfly, another pair of earrings, flowers. Uh, see here's a flower. Yep. Yeah. Uh, never stop reaching up. This one says work hard, be kind, and amazing. Things will happen. I love that. Let's see. We have cheers. Another um, princess gown. Let's see. We have some stars. No, oh, a star wand. That is so adorable. Heart. Butterfly. Happy day. Uh, magical makeover. Fairy Godmother in full bloom. So you get a good variety of ephemera in her ephemera packs. So another small flower. There's a little um, bingo card that says true love. And uh, this was the cutout of this. Um, kind of goes with the carriage and all. There's a carriage there. It's like a little snow globe. Um, this was in here. So I did pop that piece out. And then, uh, let's see, you are so adorable. And then last is this, um, it's like a Polaroid frame. With these little yellow bursts on there. So, yeah. Oh, that is Dreamlike World. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry. Dreamlike World from Selena's studio. And the dies. And, like I said, I will have the... Items linked in the description box for you to go grab them if you like. And I will have her shop link as well if you'd like to go just browse and see what you have. She's gotten new things in since this. So there are some really uh, great other dyes as well. But don't forget these. Go ahead and throw them in your cart now. So they're not gone when you want them. And uh, that's it for this video, guys. Um, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.